Hello, friends. It's kind of late. I'm kind of tired. This is a terrible idea. Let's resume. We're leaving Clown College. We're trying Castle Crush again, but now we only have five lives because this game hates me. I guess I should probably hold the controller when the game starts, huh? That's bait. You I can take out that way. You I'm hanging on to. There we go. Let's get our uh, scrappy rhino friend. I don't remember his name. We'll call him Charles. I'm sure he has an alliterative name, but I'm gonna call him Charles. Let's go, Charles. We're gonna one-shot this level, it's gonna be great. Give me them nanners. Give me that nanner, too. Oh, I probably could have used that coin, actually. It's over there. Nothing. Over there. Nothing. Bunch of nothing. Give me that. No secret in there. You leave Charles alone, you big meanie. Yeah. Get me up there. I want that coin. Cool. I, I now have one. Far cry from the 89 I had gotten before. Uh, I thought there was an arrow there because there was a secret there. I almost died for that. Give me those. I need the lives. Ah. Not good. Nope. Thank you for leaving. Is there anything actually down here? Oh, some bananas. And this nerd who's gonna kill me because I had nowhere I could go. I pushed the jump button a split second too late, but I really need to keep useless with me so I can take these guys out. Oh, right. Didn't get the stupid checkpoint. <sighs> Again, I, I know I, I feel like I say this every episode, but this is absolutely a game that would benefit from having two checkpoints instead of just one. And I shouldn't have done that. Yeah. Should not have done that. Should have kept that barrel for the sword guy. But yeah, two checkpoints per level, and this is an A-plus game. As it is, it is just rife with trolls and frustration. And I'm really looking forward to being done with it. Once again, a single banana. Gimme. You killed... You killed... Charles. Is that the name I gave him? Did I name him Charles? I don't even remember. I'm so tired. I should not be playing this game. Give me... Oh, well, that sucked. Haha. -ha. Oh. <laughs> I got stuck! I got stuck! I was just messing around. Oh, that was stupid. As I said, I'm very tired. <laughs> I can't believe I got stuck like that. How am I missing all of these? This is ridiculous. Alright, time to get serious. No more throwing for content, because that's clearly what we're doing here. To the moon, Charles. To the moon. I really wish this game had two checkpoints per level. It would be such a better game. It, 
would be such a better game. Give me that, and I didn't make it there. The coin's actually useless, because I'm not going to beat this level anyway, and I'm going to get too annoyed. Yeah, a big jump. And then there's this idiot trying to kill my rhino friend. How did I get hit? These hitboxes are trash. That was not a hit. Strong disagree. Why is it going so slow? Get out of there, Charles. All right. This, this game makes no sense with these hitboxes. How come I can cartwheel into it 15 times in a row without a problem? But this time it's like, nah, we disagree. Well, I disagree, game. I disagree. I'm pretty sure that was in the face. Unless my my perception because of my fatigue is that bad. But I'm pretty sure that was in the face, and neither of the hits that I got dinged against me should have counted. When I was a kid, I remember playing Atari 2600 with my grandfather. Just story time here while I'm doing the same excruciatingly long segment again. Um, but I remember uh, playing Atari 2600 uh, ice hockey with him. And um, he was a big fan. I, I mean, I could talk, talk about different Atari games that he was into, and he was the one who kind of got me into gaming, you know, from an early age. But uh, I know... I vividly remember him talking about, like, well, the computer's cheating, and, uh, you know, I'd always laugh at him, like, no, you're just not, you're not as good at me as me. Look at that. What is with this? And you're not as good as me at this game. But uh, sometimes, sometimes I think he was right. I think the computer does cheat. <laughs> Case in point, Donkey Kong Country 2, Diddy's Conquest. Computer's definitely cheating in this game. I don't have girl, and I'm gonna get hurt by this idiot. Okay, this time I could kill him. But I died because I cartwheeled into this guy's butt. I don't know. I don't, I don't get this game. I just don't understand. Is he completely cartwheel proof? Why? Why would he be completely cartwheel proof? What is it about this crocodile's butt cheeks? I can't believe I'm saying these words out loud that make him immune to cartwheel damage. There's a Reddit for first time sentences and I think this one should apply. What is it about this crocodile's butt cheeks that make it immune to cartwheel damage? There you go. I almost want to title the episode that because it's such a ridiculous statement. I feel like it's the clickbaitiest title I could come up with. alone. And then there's this B. Okay, that time I got it. Alright, cool. I'm just being more timid with the Bs and waiting until they're almost like, not even in line with me. So my sound there just kind of cut out. Almost have another extra life. So I can give this miserable level another attempt. Here comes that life. I really wish I could keep Charles around. 
Okay. You just need to get crushed. I really wish that was a checkpoint. Get out of here. Actually, wait, there was a... Oh, that's where the O is, too, huh? All right, cool. Glad I didn't get that K. And here comes the lag. Oh, wow. That seemed really unfair. Yeah. Totally. Totally unfair. Too many sprites on the screen. Here's a lag death for you. Thanks, game. Very generous. Don't worry, we'll have you start at the beginning again. Because we hate our players. We actively wish them ill. What? Oh, yes, it, we do know it's a children's game. Yes, we hate children. Our favorite movie? Oh, it's that uh, Halloween movie with the Halloween masks that uh, eat their brains. Yeah, that's that's our favorite. Oh, good. Off-screen thing. Perfect. Just, just... Oh. Uh, I'm not going to sing the Silver Shamrock song, guys. I, I can't. I can't do that to you, and I can't do that to myself. It will get stuck in my head, and I will hate myself for it. And I just need... Fine, whatever. Traded a hit. Definitely going to die. Probably from a B. Maybe from getting crushed. I don't know. We'll see. I really hate that this game doesn't remember how many lives you have when you save, though. That's such a huge oversight. It's an excruciatingly long section. Sure, I'll get the K, because I'm definitely going to beat this whole level this time. And find all the letters. I like my little, like, extra boost jump that I occasionally get. Mm. This guy's not even hard to take care of, but it's just the hitbox stuff in this is so bad. Gimme. Okay. Tremendous. We get another attempt at this miserable section. At least getting the checkpoint would feel like an accomplishment with this life, but I don't think it's going to happen because I've only got useless here. Probably going to die in a stupid way. What happened to that guy? What happened to Snuffles? There we go. We gotta get up here fast. There we go. If you don't get up there fast, you're done for. Checkpoint. Nice. That actually does feel like an accomplishment. Uh oh. Trade. Jeez, I thought he was going to get crushed before he could throw that. Oh, right, there was the alternate path there. I completely forgot about that. Okay. That's where we get the bird that makes this section 10,000 times easier. Yeah. Ugh. This is one of those times where he jumps too high and got me killed. All right. Trade to girl. Oh, it's right there. No, but I was holding left. She ducked when I was holding left. Screw all of these guys. Give me that. Give me all that. Oh, I didn't even remember I got that DK coin, huh? feels kind of trashy. Probably doesn't even remember I got this before. This 
love a DK barrel. So I didn't feel like I was hanging on by the barest of threads. Yep, there's my weird, ugly mole coin. Alright. Oh, I remember this section. Okay. I do that, and then that. And now it's reversed. So we have to do this, and then this. Okay, that's not bad. Any secrets here? Doesn't look like it. How about it here? Nope, no secrets. He's looking for secrets. Oh, right, birds. I don't even want to kill them. I just want them to go away and let me get that barrel that I'm hearing. Where is it? No. Oh, it's the bees. Why is it the bees? Ah! Okay. Die. Die. Gimme. This might be the... Might be the furthest I've gotten, because I don't remember ever seeing that G before. Oh no. Switched a girl. Wow, that came back really fast. I do kind of vaguely remember this. That comes so fast. I think I got there once and died like that. And now the checkpoint is so far back. I really wish this game had two, two checkpoints per level. I'm telling you, this is like a masterpiece waiting to happen with two checkpoints. But the trolley garbage brings it down so far. gonna get these hang on to this you coming come on riveting gameplay here oh there was, was there something to the left there I don't think so I think it was my certain doom nope wrong guy Gotta have useless for this section. It's actually kind of amazing how much this game has made me appreciate useless more than Harry. First level, I thought, oh, Harry, that's pretty cool. She does cool stuff. But then it's like, oh, wait, no, she's actually horrible. She climbs slower. Her hair twirl does not affect enemies at all. She is just a damaged sponge. She is a target. I don't even remember what's next. Oh, it's the bees. Back to you. Come here, sponge. Going this way. This, actually, this section is not bad. I was trying to cheese it last time because I thought there was a clear pattern going on. But there was not a clear pattern going on. Give me that. I need those lives. Okay, so what do we do here? Stand in the middle? And just jump, 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 jump. Okay. Now that I can actually see what we're doing, that makes it a lot more feasible. Is this? Nope, 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 no! Nope. I'm, I'm gonna get crushed. I'm gonna get crushed. Ugh, oh, come on. I mean, I don't actually care about these singular bananas. These are not actually bait for me. I feel like I have to be close to the end of this horrific scenario. No! She just stopped. Oh, this is brutal. This is brutal. So you, you've got to have useless for that section or you're done. Missed a lot of bananas there. Get 
give me all those. That's not what I wanted. Is this where I want him or do I want her? I don't remember. Oh, almost got crushed. I, there's got to be some kind of a secret over there. Just the way that's set up, it looks like it's a secret. Also, can we just talk about all these poor animals that are being mercilessly butchered? Not only by, you know, me, but just from the misfortune of living in this hellhole of a castle? That's, that's so unfortunate. Got these birds, at least I think they survive, unless I stomp on their faces, but as tempting as that is, I mean, no, no, back to you. I'm gonna go this way, and then you're dead. And then I'm gonna go this way, and you're dead. And then I'm gonna go this way, and then you're dead. Give me that bo bo box, barrel. Give me that extra life again. I think I want to switch to him now, right? I think this is... Nope, I don't. It's immediately after this section. The section that I'm not a fan of. It's actually not that bad once you know what to expect, but... Then we're gonna bust through all these. Back to her. Grab a banana just to tempt fate. Perfect. Switch back to useless. Uh, oh, I'm done. I can't. I can't do it. I, I'm not gonna make it. Why was there a bee there? There, mu there must have been a secret I missed. Oh yeah, look at all the secret I missed. You need both of them. Yeah, I think if you had both of them, you could do it too. Well, screw that thing and we. Nothing. I get nothing for my trouble. Outstanding. Clapper's Cavern? That sounds like it should be a boss fight, but instead it's going to be a let's spam save. Whew. 23 minutes on that last level. All right, let's try this next one. I don't know if we're actually going to play it all the way through, but I at least want to see what it looks like. Oh, no. What are you? Oh, right. I forgot about that mechanic. Um, these guys must have already been on the ice for them to actually be like that. Uh, oh, good. Just make them angry. That should help. Um... Oh, that was not long enough, dude. You gotta freeze that stuff. Uh, okay. That fish can eat me. Give me my fish. Give me my fish. Give me the fish. Oh, that was super weird. Checkpoint? <laughs> Amazing. First enemy. Can't even take him out. Uh, I'm gonna die. These things are gonna get me. See? I knew it. I had an itch on my nose. Oh, you just suicided on that one. Alright. I guess that's a decision that you have made. Uh, can I go up? No. I just took a wrong turn, I guess. I found a secret, but did not proceed in the level. No fish. Oh, I would have lost the fish anyway, I guess. Oh, I thought you was gonna get me. Oh, he did. Great. Because, of course, you can't cartwheel uphill on ice. No checkpoint, so let's do the entire thing over again. Get out of here. I don't care. Okay. So I feel like I maybe got a little lucky on that one, and then really unlucky on the next. Oh, good. She just died in midair. She just stopped moving. Just outright stopped moving. 
Like, what if what if I hair twirl into a bee? Well, would that be bad? I don't believe you. Let's try it. Her hair twirl should absolutely do damage. The fact that it does not is actually kind of disgraceful. Okay. Nope. Don't. Do it again. There we go. Gonna die. If that fishy gets me, I am done for. Can we get on the stupid fish, please? We did it again. Did it again. Right into there. Let's just get up. Just get up. Try to find a checkpoint. Try to not lose our minds. Oh, good. Oh, good. Extra good. Look how close I was to that checkpoint. That usually means that there's a barrel nearby, and there it is. No, just go away. Just all of you, go away. I don't want to deal with any of you. Oh, that was cheap. When I talk about cheap trolley stuff in this game, that's the kind of stuff I'm talking about. Alright. Well, I got an extra life and died for it. But I also got a checkpoint, so that's good. Okay. Man, that jump's a little hazardous. Okay, get out of here. No. Stop it. I bet there's a secret down there if you brave the fish. Come on. Oh, get out. Go. Oh. I wonder if I was supposed to keep that barrel for another section. Oh, come on, dude. Oh. Oh, no. I didn't actually mean to jump on it. I didn't recognize the fact that it was girl on the barrel. I was trying to get in the barrel. All right. I think that's enough for today. <laughs> we did two levels. That second one was actually kind of fun. Uh, so I don't want to wreck this episode by going to a level that is probably going to be horrific. So thank you all so much for watching this episode. I feel like we got to be getting close here, right? Like, we got to be getting close to the end. Um, we got a dude over there on the left who is not the boss, but what, what else did we do? I don't even... Oh, that's Clubbus Kiosk. What do you want? So that, this isn't even a level, so that's cool. We're done with that guy. So yeah, all we have here is, uh, well, I guess whatever's left, but we've got this and then maybe a boss fight? I don't know. We look like we're pretty close to the top of the castle, so we gotta be almost done with this game. Uh, but as I said, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, you know what to do. As always, be kind to yourselves, be kind to each other. We will see you in the next episode.